What is going on everybody? My name is The Sheik and welcome back to Gravity Rush. Last time we helped the evil guy steal like the crystal that supposedly protects the town or something. I don't really know. But I, what the hell was his name? It was something weird because I remember I had trouble pronouncing it. But I can't remember what the hell it was. I also have no idea where we're going. I should probably look at it. What the hell? Set a navy. Okay, we did it. I did it. I managed to set up a location to the next zone. And now we're gonna go there. I'm gonna slide the whole way there. I can't. I, I can't. I need to go up. And... Okay. Oh, it's, we're so close. How do I... That is not how I come out of it. How do I, like, exit the gravity modes? I wish I knew or remembered. <laughs> Begin the mission. We shall start it. Um, Pandora's Fountains. Let Pandora open the box to your soul. Hmm. Wonder if she can shed some light on my situation. Mao. What is it, Dusty? You curious too? Let's see what she has to say. Is she a fortune teller? Um, excuse me? The shifter without a past. Adrift on the river of forgottenness. Oh, wait, what? Not forgetfulness. Ah. I have been expecting you, cat. You are lost. You seek to ask, who am I? And why am I here? Well, now that you mention it. And that cat-like creature, your faithful, faithful meeting has brought your powers. That, that's amazing. How did you know all that? Yeah, please enlighten us. Oh, that's a scary little doll. Say hello, Pandora. Hello. I see all. I know all. Oh, boy. Hmm. What's that, Pandora? This young lady is about to meet a man who will change her destiny. What? A man? Wh who? Your fates are intertwined. Together, you will open the door to a new world. I like the sound of that. Forgot my past. Tell me more about this meeting with Mr. Destiny. What? What's that, Pandora? He's where... And this envelope contains instructions to find him. I'll take it. Thanks for the fortune. That envelope also has the bill. You can pay on the way out. <laughs> Come to Pandora's fortunes anytime you seek wisdom. Episode 5, A Meeting with Destiny. I got the voices all messed up. I don't even know what the voices are anymore. There goes my meal budget. That teller cost me a fortune. Ah! Alright. Let's check the instructions there so I can hurry up and find Mr. Destiny. Wow, I can barely read her writing. The white flyer, the blue flag on high, the red runner, the open gateway, and the invitations underground. Um, okay then. I don't get this new age nonsense. New age nonsense. What the hell was that? Maybe we should chase after that bird that's flying. Sound like paper. Hmm, wait. Is that a pigeon? The white flyer? Oh, is that... I don't even know if I read that correctly. But we got to follow the pigeon. I thought maybe a flyer, like a leaflet sort of thing. I wasn't expecting an actual thing to be flying. Oh, I guess then I should get this. Just so I have more energy. To fly after him. He's getting away. I might lose sight of him. Alright, gotta get that other one. Okay, okay. He stopped. I don't know how to stop. How do I exit gravity mode? Oh, okay, there we go. Of course, why didn't I think of that before? It's the opposite to R1, is L1, and that is how we stop it. Ooh, soaring so high above the sky. Where are you going, pigeon? Wait for me. Don't do anything stupid now. I'm a comet! Shit! <laughs> no! <laughs> God dang it. Oh, I can't believe it. Alright, I'm gonna walk up this wall. No, not. I'm gonna fly all the way. I gotcha! Um... Shit, let's get away. Shoot, it flew off on me. Even if I could catch up, how would I know which one was the right f white flyer? <laughs> huh? Is somebody crying? 
Sounds like it. It's okay, kid. I'll help you out the door. Is this Mr. Destiny? Is the kid? I was not expecting this. I, I can't find my daddy. I want my daddy. The kid can't be Mr. Destiny. That'd be a little weird. Hey there, little guy. What's wrong? Did you get split up from your dad? I was in a tunnel, and and when I came out, it went away. Now it's a wall. The kid's crying up a storm, but I can't make any sense of what's going on. Oh, what he's going on about? Are you lost? Where did you last see your father? Um, well, I saw s someone wearing blue in the tunnel, and I, I, I thought it was my dad, but he went away. Blue? Is that the blue flag part of the prophecy? Hold on a second, okay? I need to check something real quick. If the white flyer was that pigeon, there was the blue flag on high. Hmm. If that boy's father is wearing blue clothes, then I wonder. Hmm. Does his father have something to do with the prophecy? I guess I should look for him just in case. He might lead me to the man of my destiny. Don't you worry, kid. I'll find your dad, okay? You just stay tight. Oh, you stay right here in front of this wall. And don't move an inch. Got it? Okay. Alright, cool. So, on high, it means I'll probably go up high. I'll find your dad, just wait there, okay? The next hint was about a blue flag on high. Which presumably would be close by, considering this is where the white flag took me. White flag? White flyer. I'm going up! The top of the TV tower would be a good place to start. Now, would that? Would there also happen to be some sort of blue flag at the top of the TV station? Well, isn't that just handy? This is the blue flag? It's just a piece of laundry. Well, alright. It's an impressive piece of laundry. But now what? I hope this underwear doesn't belong to that kid's dad. Hmm. Well, blue flag or not, I suppose I should keep looking around. Next up are the Red Runners. Is there anything around here that fits the prophecy? Huh? What's that noise? Is it gonna be people running? Red clothing? Oh, it's balloons? Oh no, he let loose. Red balloons? Hmm. Of course! The Red Runner! It's like, it catch all the balloons, huh? I'm just gonna get one. Do I need- why do I need to catch these? I, I thought I had a time for a second there, but it's just telling me that there's seven. Oh, I brought some chick with me. Killing everybody in town. My bad guys, I didn't mean to. Hey, I'm pretty good at this. <laughs> Not doing too bad. Are they gonna like keep drifting up? Alright, where's the last one at? There it is. Alright, I can just about get it! Ah, I did it. I managed to get the last one. I got them all in one sim. I think that's all of them. Ah, uh, you would be wrong. Oh, there's another one. Don't worry, we can get it. We have magical gravity bender powers. It doesn't matter where you go, balloon. I will take the bench with me. People. Oh my goodness, it's amazing they haven't locked me up for constantly making people fly around. I've probably killed quite a few people because of my gravity antics. I've never seen a balloon move so fast. Me neither. Where the hell's it going? Isn't this where we were in the park where we stole like the thing? Blah, blah, blah. And it just happened to land right next to this guy. Is this dad or that kid? That'd be nice. We actually found him. It's like he was waiting for that balloon to come to him. Um, excuse me. That red ru Um, I mean, red balloon. Is that yours? Um, I'm sure he'll love this. Oh, right. Excuse me, miss. Have you seen my son around? I've been looking for him. He went running to explore a tunnel. And then he vanished. Hmm. He is wearing blue. Oh! Oh! Yes, yes! I know where he is. He asked me to find you, actually. Your son is waiting in front of that wall with uh, all the graffiti. I told him to wait there. Thank you. I can't take my eyes off that boy for a second. I'm lucky he ran into you. 
Oh, of course. I couldn't possibly ignore a crying child. Or kid. <laughs> Come on, I'll take you to him. This guy isn't the man of my destiny, is he? Um, hold on. Before we go, I need to check something. I found the Red Runners, so next up is the opening, the opened gateway. The graffiti on that wall kind of looked like a door. Maybe that's it. I guess I better get him back to his son first. Sorry to keep you waiting. Let's go. Do I actually? Is he actually gonna follow me? Hey. Do, oh wait, wait. No, no way. No way! I'm not gonna treat him like an object then, but I can't even have to do it. Is it something to do with this? No? How do I do this? There we go, we got it, we got it. You don't... He, you let go of the balloon, man. Do, do you want that? We can go get it, look. No, okay, okay. Okay, alright, alright. We're probably both going to die, because I'm not the best at picking the thing. Last shot, I'm starting to feel a little gravity stick. Oh, he disappeared? But it would've been fine, I made it, alright? Oh, sorry. Alright, let, let's get down here. We, we, you know what? We'll take it slow. We'll, we'll go down on the low damn ground. You know how it is. Oh, I can walk with him. Amazing. Alright, let me just wait. There we go. Alright. And then I'm gonna do this. Amazing. <laughs> I love it. Let's get you back to your son then. You just hang tight, man. And it doesn't use any of my energy. Awesome. It means I can run around all day with a floating man at my side. If this is right, <laughs> don't worry about me. Please hurry. Uh, we're almost there, man. Don't even worry about it. Don't even... Oh. Oh, the graffiti actually turned into a door. Amazing. Where'd the kid go? And that wall? It became a door. I don't know where it was written. <laughs> I don't see him here. Uh, I told him to stay right there. I bet he ran off to explore that tunnel again. There's something strange about it. Don't worry, I'll go and find him. Uh, okay, sure. Um, now what? Let me check the letter. The open gateway is next, and then the invitation on the ground. Aha! Maybe this is the gateway. Hey, hang on, I'm coming with you. He hasn't moved an inch, literally. <laughs> oh, well, this is kind of chilling. We had our nice music. What happened to all that? Excuse me, miss. Pardon me if this seems a bit abrupt, but... Uh-oh. Where is he going? <laughs> Where is this going? Sorry. <laughs> yes. What is it? Don't... S doesn't something seem odd about this tunnel? The air feels different, feels different in here, like we're being watched. Hmm, like father, like son, I guess. Oh, uh, really? It feels normal to me. Have you ever wondered where this place came from? Maybe none of this is real. Maybe it's all just an illusion. And we're just figments of someone's imagination. What the fuck is he talking about? He's getting real deep all of a sudden. Okay, this guy is making zero sense now. Um, you must be getting tired from looking for your son, your boy. I'll go on ahead and check for him alone, okay? Yeah, don't worry about it, man. I, I get him. This is a really weird-ass looking place. Maybe I should make this my new home rather than living in sewers. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Awesome. What is this place? I have no idea. Meow! Dusty, where are you going? I can't shift gravity without you. Ugh, this is all that swindling fortune teller's fault. All this crazy stuff happening. None of this was in the prophecy. I guess there's still that final part left. But for the time being, I need to worry about catching Dusty. Do I just have to run? Uh, there we go. Okay, catch Dusty. I can roll. What the hell is that? Well, they look like enemies, huh? I'm just gonna run past y'all. Don't even worry about me. I said, don't you even worry about me. And then you start shooting stuff at me? Of all the places for Dusty to run off. <laughs> he had to do it when all the enemies appear. 
Is this like inside one of those vortexes that appears in the sky or something? Are they doing this madness? What happens if I get hit by one of those? Is that? I don't think that life bar has been there the whole time. I'm pretty sure that's new. Has it yet? Yeah, no, is it? Did I have life before? I must have had life before. Did it appear in a bar like that? Hmm. I know it's been a while, but I don't recall there ever being a life bar in the top left hand corner like that. Did I catch Dusty? Um. Where does that pipe lead? Wait. Maybe this is related to the prophecy. Where's that ladder? That's right. An opened gateway, followed by an invitation underground. Maybe that pipe is my invitation underground. I sure hope it is. Anyway, I've come too far to turn back now. That you have. Let's go into the well. We're gonna Mario this shit up. I knew it. Ever since we found the pipes to begin with. I knew it had something to do with Mario. Do we fall through the whole freaking world? Oof! Oh. Huh? Oh! You're... You are... You have arrived. I can't read. I'm the man who's going to change your destiny. Uh... What? I just remembered. I have an appointment. Wait! What? I am the creator of this world. What? You... Poor, poor old man. Being stuck down here all alone must have really got to you, eh? And as creator, I have a request. Oh, I see. You need help finding your way home. I guess we're in the same boat there. No, no, not... Wait, you need me to open a bottle, is that it? Childproof caps do not concern. Alright then, I guess... Listen when I... when a person speaks. So you're a person now? I thought you said you were the creator. Ah, no. I am the creator. The letter from the fortune teller led me to what I thought was just an... eccentric, lonely old man. But I would soon come to discover the truth behind the fortune. And how this man would change my destiny. Shit. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> we start over here. Huh? How did I end up back here? And the tunnel, it's gone again. Meow. Dusty, where were you? Don't run off like that. Meow. <sighs> well, I guess this whole man of my destiny thing was just a sham. I should have known better than to listen to a fortune teller. That crazy old man's about as far from destiny as one can get. Meow. What? You disagree? Oh, come on. Maybe I should look for that old man. He's a bit strange, but he seems nice enough. Maybe I didn't quite catch the rest of that. Meet with Destiny. Well, we did it. We went on one hell of a wild goose chase, but I managed to find the man who would change my destiny. How will we change it? I do not know. Hopefully not in any weird perverted ways, because we don't need that shit, man. I'm, I'm just a... Uh, I don't know what I am. I'm a crazy gravity shifting lady that has no memory of anything. And needs to save these towns folks from some guy that has stolen their... <laughs> So, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I'll probably end this episode here. I like to keep these ones nice. Did that kid just age up? No, you all saw it as well, right? I'm not just tripping out. That kid was running around. He slowly faded away. And then that guy appeared out of nowhere. Is that how y'all age up in this world? Oh, it's not, I thought you were another kid. But you just said, check. Eat my killer legs. Get back. <gasps> I turned him to children. Become adults. Let's see this happen. We'll see this happen one more time, then I end the episode. Come on, do it. Alright, alright. Old man. Oh, she disappeared. Well, that kid disappeared. Everybody be disappearing. Alright, we need to not disappear. Everybody stick with me. Come with me, everybody. It's been fun. Is that a dog? Is that a wiener dog? No, it's not. This is where I want to be. I want to be on this. 
There we go, I did it. Everybody just disappeared, what the hell? I don't know, but anyway, I'm going to end this episode here, so thank you all very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this episode, and that you come back and join me for another exciting episode of Gravity Rush, where we're going to go to the next location. We're, we're looking for some old man that's apparently going to change my destiny. How he's going to do it, I have no idea, but we shall find out next time. So, peace out. Yep, he doesn't like the sound. The swans are glowing. Um, should I do something? Um... I run through this door. Open up. Shit. Do do your electric tail on it, man. Don't hit me. Ah, oh, he's gonna eat me. He's actually gonna eat me.